Hi, this is Penn. Um, some of you may have noticed that I've been missing from Facebook for about a year. So I thought I'd make my re-entry with a Christmas tour of the house. And right now, you're seeing some mostly antique um, manger scenes. And... And I have a table of numerous nativities. And then another shelf, small nativities. And then a shelf with a Mexican nativity, an Indian nativity, and what I think is a Russian nativity. And then there's more nativities on the the shelf. Again, mostly antique or hand painted. And then, so we don't skip it, we'll go into the red and black Christmas room. This is our Earnhardt bathroom. And I always try to do uh, black and red trees for the Earnhardt colors. There's a black poinsettia. And then we come out of there and there's a floral arrangement. Next to that is my Arizona nature tree. Most of those ornaments were bought in Arizona on trips to see my Arizona mom and dad. Another nativity. The tree next to it I call my white tree. There's four nativities under there. And then the ornaments are all Mostly white, cream, crystal, gold, silver, um, a few exceptions. Um, several of those came from my Grandma Schwark in Green Lake. Over here is uh, both Hallmark trees, Hallmark cars. On the right, we have a Tiffany. And on top of the desk, there's two, four, six, eight, ten nativities, maybe. Truck, Hummer truck tree, but also has calope on it. Calope. There's about seven ornaments that go up and down. That's an antique. Trucks and cars I've been collecting for 20 years. That's an LED nativity scene. It's pretty unique. I've had that again for probably 20 years. Next to it is a red poinsettia.
mental is the dog, dog stockings with their pictures and the pictures of dogs from the past. And shotgun show, um, garland. There's a, an arrangement I made out of blue points it is. And this is what I call the blue tree. It's got a unique copper. Put stars on the ceiling. These are mostly hallmark ornaments. Ornaments from the past. It's a really eclectic tree. It always has blue lights on it. We used to have blue lights on our Christmas tree. And here's another floral arrangement I made. Oh, I'm sorry, here's more nativities. Different variety. Okay. And then the floral nativity, or floral arrangement. These are all Jim Shore ornaments here. Uh, quite a few nativities. Uh, there's Christmas dogs. Um, there's a nativity set of four ornaments, separate ornaments. The Mary and Joseph, a uh, shepherd, a king, a sheep. This is my penguin tree. thing is to find the buttons on all these ornaments. Anyway, they're all automated. And um, some of them are connected together.
that's our puppy Serena. All right, this is what I call the interactive tree. Each ornament does something. Music, movement. This is my favorite, it's been here a couple years. my peanuts dancers. All these on this table do something. play music and move. This is the magic chord tree and the philosophy behind it is the ornaments are linked and will move to the music of the other ornament. This is another thrift store find. I'm not sure how old it is, but um, you can tell by the styrofoam pellets it's got to be from a different era. <laughs> Here we have uh, kind of an overflow tree. It's got the dated ornaments from Hallmark, which I started collecting in 92. So obviously there's